Sup YouTube, Pyron with some more fucking underused, mate. Let's get into it. So I start with my Blitz, not surprisingly. And they send out this Golurk thing I've never seen before, which is kind of weird. They go for the Protect, which doesn't block Stealth Rocks for the lols. Um, I go for the Taunt, just, I don't know, sort of scout, see what it's going to do. It does go for a Stealth Rock and then gets pissed and switches into Raikou, which is perfectly okay with me because I can just psych it. And cool guys don't look at explosions, so my head is turned away from the screen. But uh, I think both of those dudes just uh, got taken out. So, Togekiss. Oh, Togekiss. I'm going to speed this up. Because, yeah, T-Wave and Air Slash. Just dick move. Dick move. I, just, I don't really care too much if Antlion is taken out. He's got up Toxic Spikes, so... His job is done if he can slow down the silly Togekiss. Or whatever it is, teammate in the future. Oh, yeah, Antlion just can't do anything. So, yeah, sort of 30% chance of actually doing anything with um, T-Wave and Air Slash. So, yeah, it's pretty retarded. I probably shouldn't have gone for the Volt Switch there in retrospect. I could have taken it out with another Thunderbolt, but no matter. So once again, air slash T-Bolt. <laughs> Wonderful bullshit. They can just be sped up. More air slash, but Brave Bird takes it down to fucking 1%. Excuse my language. But yeah, that's so lame. Okay. Extreme speed. Obvious extreme speed is obvious, but he stays in for it, so... Yep. Bye-bye, token kiss. Send out the Empoleon. Go for the Protect. Okay then. Probably just scout what I was going to use. So I go for close combat. And once again, a close combat, which is cool with me, because I didn't really want to stay in against a Napoleon. But obviously, if he feels like he can get a free move with uh, switching into the Ghost type, that's cool, because I can just flare Blitz and do horrible amounts of damage on the Gold Look. Going for the rain dance, which is okay. Um, interesting move, I'm sure. You must really not like Fang. Kind of pointless if you ask me. What's funny is he's got an Arcanine as well, and now he can't use it. So Kingdra with a swift swim, which is, I suppose, a reasonable enough reason to use rain dance, but whatever. So extreme speeds to do some damage before it's taken out. Go go with Poly. Good old Poseidon. So, Draco Meteor, which is kind of silly. And is taken out by the Ice Beam. So, yep, Battle of the Empoleons, but mine's got a cooler name, so it's going to win. No, I don't, but yeah, Scald, Burn Axe. And the rain stops. So, like Aqua Ring, yeah! How about no? So yeah. Also, burn hacks. Uh, burn hacks for a burn hacks. But yep, I just roar out the uh, the aqua ring because that's a sort of a clear advantage. And cool story, bro. His arcanine, I'm pretty sure, stays in for the skull, which is nope. Okay, my mistake. He sends out a polyon, and I go for the skull, which does yeah. I don't know. Not very much, but whatever. I got the Arcanine to switch out. And Grass Knot for the lulls. They go for the Roar, which is a really silly move. Because Raikou is just going to rip face on either of those dudes with Thunderbolt. And Cap Bolt bringing it home for the team. With yet another T Bolt, because Extreme Speed was never going to do anything. that is all. I hope you enjoy the video guys and I will see you next time. If you're here for the next time. Which it should be because I don't. I reckon these battles have been pretty cool. Good boo.